So this week we're coming from Ecclesiastes 11, 1 and 2. And it says, send your grain across the seas and in time, profits will flow back to you. But divide your investments around many places for you do not know what risks may lie ahead. Jay the Motivator, to God be the glory. Now this is a good one here. So it says, send your grain across the seas and in time, profits will flow back to you. You see, it doesn't say profits will come to you immediately. It doesn't say profits will come to you instantaneously. It doesn't say profits will come back to you at once. It says in time. And you see, that's the thing that we're not mindful of a lot of times. We want things right then and there. We don't want to give time for those things to mature. We don't want to give time for those things to to come to pass. We don't want to give time for those things to to cultivate and, and grow. However, all great things take time. It took nine months for you to be born. It took 18 years for you to be 18. It took 30 years for you to be 30. It will take 60 years for you to be 60. There are no shortcuts in this. And so just like you in your life, it takes time to develop. The same goes for your business as well. It takes time for you to earn your first customer. It takes time for you to earn their loyalty. It takes time for you to gain those referrals. It takes time for you to go from your first to your 10th, from your 10th to your 100th, from your 100th to your 1,000th. It takes time. But during that time, enjoy the process, trust the process. Find out little ways that you can improve. How can you better serve your your guests? How can you better serve your client? How can you better serve your customer? What ways can you improve your processes so you can do what you're doing more efficiently? So you can do what you're doing, but at a better rate. So you can do what you're doing, but serve the client better. What skills is it that you can learn in between that time that it takes for those profits to come back to you? Be mindful of the other ways that you're able to profit yourself. Don't just rely on one route to get there. Be mindful, what other ways can you take to get to that same destination? Who is it that you can speak to? What resources are out there for you? What books can you read? What audios can you listen to? Who can you sit down with as a mentor? Be mindful. There's not only one way to get there. So make sure that you look at all the different avenues available to you. So this week, I encourage you, be patient for your profit. As you build up your business, as you develop yourself, as you cultivate those relationships, give it time to grow. So with that being said, to God be the glory, be great.